before we start this video, y'all better start commenting and subscribing. There's a lot of people that watch me, but y'all ain't subscribing. I'm over here, I'm sitting up here with 2,000 views and stuff, and I'm sitting here with like 200, 270 subscribers. Y'all better press this damn subscribe button and like it. What up, what up? It's Talking Ish with Chris on this joint again today. Somebody asked me a question recently um, to give my thoughts and opinions on men, particularly straight men that um, holler at ladies and why they sometimes get, you know, the rudeness from you ladies or, you know what I mean, you get the, <laughs> they get the, sh most men get the shut, not most men, but some men get the shut down and it's like, so let me give you guys a couple reasons, but I'm gonna give you on both sides, not just my side or whatever, but I mean, not my side, but as a man, but I'm also give you just what the women be thinking. And even me as a gay man, and I've had men approach me and I've had to kind of shut down. So here's one of the things that I feel like, guys, like sometimes you, you have to already remember that most women are already subconsciously put on guard that they gotta watch out. They've already been told as little girls, there's men out there that want your pussy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hell, some niggas even want to take my pussy. I got to watch my goddamn goodies and treats and shit. Niggas be on it trying to fuck. Slide in my DMs and shit. Hey, what's up with it? Hey, nigga. That's not how you approach me. Sometimes. <laughs> they want the pussy and shit. You know what I mean? So, from there, they got to guard it. So, for the most part, they've already been on guard. Then you have to understand, you got to check your surroundings and stuff. You got to think about where you at when you approach this woman. If you see her buying groceries or down there in her phone or walking, you know, on Target pushing her basket and then you bust a left out the, <laughs> off the aisle. Hey, what up, baby? How you doing? You cute. You, I just want to tell you you beautiful and stuff. I can't tell you beautiful. And she's just looking at you like it's in, it's all in prison. It's all in presentation. Everything is in pre. Thank you. Everything is in presentation. You you know what I mean? And how you approach, you got to think about that. Especially if you looking busted. Now, this is another thing, too. Some of you niggas is getting shut down because y'all fucking ugly as fuck. That's why sometimes you're just getting fucked up and fucked over. Some of you niggas got busted ass shoes. Your hair ain't done. Your breath is humming. Your teeth is all fucked up. It's a lot of reasons why she gave you the, I don't want to talk to you. You know what I mean? And then y'all come on so aggressively. Like, damn. Like, okay, it's cool that you like it. What we say? What we say? It's usually ugly dudes. Ugly. It's usually ugly dudes, you know what I mean, that 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 want to, you know, try to holler and stuff. And it's like, when you at least see the girl coming in your, when you're at least trying to get in that girl's peripheral view, at least, you know, give her a couple extra seconds to kind of notice you, to kind of analyze you, you know, let her kind of quickly, because the brain is quick. She can look you up and down very fast, because I know I can real quick and understand whether I want to fuck you, date you, whatever, you know what I mean? So, so I get to know you a little more. But I'm just saying, like, give her a little time to kind of see you and notice you before you just roll up on her. But like I say, sometimes you got to let her know right then and there, you know what I mean? Every scenario, situation is going to be different. Now, me personally, I like a little aggressive. I like a guy to come up and tell me, you know what I mean, what they think about me or... Uh, that they're interested in me, even if they're not the most attractive to me or whatever. Um, you know what I mean? Hey, just a simple thank you is good enough or, you know, just a smile. And, you know, sometimes I even hug like, oh, thank you. You know what I mean? And that's kind of it. <laughs> I'm going to take up for the men, though. Sometimes it's just some mean ass girls out here that just bitter, can't tell them nothing. You know what I mean? Half of them might ain't been told they was pretty all their life. So when another man come and tell them, you know what I mean? They don't, they don't know how to take a compliment some people just don't know how to take compliments you know what i mean and it's just that's just a problem that's an issue that they got to work out for themselves that's nothing you can do you just let her know she's beautiful or you wanted her number or something i think girls need to go back i think we all need to go back to old-fashioned where somebody just wants to meet you in person let's stop doing all these instagram meetings and these facebook meetings meet a nigga just at the grocery store down at target or whatever be happy that he's approaching you because you could be one of the girls that's not getting approached. it's a girl right now crying her out like, i ain't got no man i ain't got no dick I ain't got this. Oh, send me a man, Lord. And, you're, and here it is, your bitter ass out here getting hollered at, and you can't even take the fucking compliment, bitch. Take the compliment. And y'all come on more aggressive than usually. I'm not going to even judge it on, on looks. How about we judge it on confidence? Most men that are confident, 
You know what I mean? For the situation you're in, you gotta judge, you know what I mean, her and stuff and look at her. On one end, too, ladies, if a man doesn't stop at no, you do gotta give him a little credit. Like, he's trying, you know what I mean? Like, like, he's put forth some effort, you know what I mean? Like, you guys, he's always screaming and crying about how disrespected you feel, how you're upset about this and niggas don't do this or that. And here's a man complimenting you and also trying to get to know you and you just being mean as fuck but then screaming that there ain't no good niggas but there was a good man. Her situation, what she's, who she's around, what she's doing before you just roll up and tell her. I mean, I understand sometimes some shit's on a... Chose to skip on them. You know what I mean? For whatever reason it was. It could have been a good reason, could have been a bad reason. But I'm just saying, you know, give, him the, give the guy a try. He try to holler at you, see what's up. Especially if you ain't been dating in a while and most of the niggas you've been talking to is bootsy ass anyways. You might as well try to see what's up. You know what I mean? I like somebody to come and say, hey, what's up? How you doing? i like to take you out. You know what I mean? I like a man like that. But that's just me, though. <laughs> but... You know what I mean? You gotta, you gotta understand. You think of your daughters. A lot of you men have daughters and stuff, or nieces. Think about you know, you are, you know how a man is. You know men are aggressive. You know some of y'all nasty as fuck. You know, what I mean? you know what I mean? Like, and I mean, let's just keep it real. I, hey, I deal with gay niggas, straight niggas, whatever. So it's like. You gotta like think about your like you wouldn't want your nobody no man to be like that on your daughter and stuff. So don't be like that on no woman either. Don't be all too aggressive. Too some of you guys are coming off as creeps. Some of you guys are coming off as goddamn <laughs> little molesters and shit. You up here fifty years old and shit. You know what I mean? This girl is you know twenty. Like eh, nah. And then you wonder like you gotta understand it's all about energy. That energy feels different. I know what that feels like. Where where you feel like you're being a preyed on you feel like you're like this is a predator you know what i mean and that's why a lot of times you guys get shut down too is because you come off like a predator and that's intimidating a little scary you know the thing one thing i feel like you ladies sometimes need to stop if you at the club and you know you gotta that's why i say are you really coming to the club to dress for men or are you coming there to shut down other bitches because it's like you sit up here and dress all nice, you got all your makeup and hair and all this stuff. You know you're beautiful, or at least you're feeling beautiful. You you look beautiful, you know what I mean? Whatever. You're beautiful to somebody. <laughs> and you gotta think about there are there gonna be fucking men that's gonna hit on you. Especially I'm tired of you girls sitting up here wearing these goddamn workout clothes. Ain't get to well, nobody's gym. But you sitting here in full Adidas. <laughs> gear on and shit got ivy park on and shit ain't hit nobody's gym motherfucking same ass <laughs> leggings you've been wearing as tight as fuck you showing all your body and stuff you're screaming please talk to me holler at me look what i have so well, of course you're gonna get horny ass niggas that's gonna want to fucking holler at you and then you got the nerve to turn up your nose no you asked for that you don't want that bitch put on a full Walmart, Fruit of the Loom, sweatsuit on, that's baggy as fuck. <laughs> you won't have to worry about getting too many flies on your shit. But all I'm saying is, other than that, that's why men are going to talk you, you. You're that's Don't you want a man to come talk to you? You know what I mean? Now, some like I said, some men come off as creeps, but I know not every man, a lot of dudes that I've seen guys come in, and I've just seen it live, the girl just, uh... And I'm looking, I'm like, shit, I fuck. I'm like, what's wrong with you? Fuck. <laughs> why she why she do that? Like, bitch, look at your shoes. You should be happy he talking to you. <laughs> Them old scuffed up ass heels in the back, bitch. Right, get out of yeah. here. <laughs> Wobbly ass ankle, bitch. <laughs> but I'm just saying, like, dang, let a man holler at you in some time. Be be glad and grateful, shit. That you are talking to, or is it? But then again, now here's another thing, fellas. You gotta realize too. Sometimes she didn't want you to. She don't want to talk to you because she don't like no bone. <laughs> so sometimes that's that too. That's why you got shut down, nigga. She like a little meow, meow, meow. So, <laughs> so she don't want that. I've been, I, it's been times I've been thinking girls was straight, and they was like, uh, -uh I like pussy. I'm like, ooh, okay, all right, sicky, sicky. I think that's just one of my, that's my take on, you know, why some of you guys may feel like, well, why is my holla at a girl? You know what I mean? Sometimes it's either just, she, she's not feeling it. She's not in, you know what I mean? Um, just look by looking at you or based off. Here's another thing too. When you guys go hollering out with your friends, sometimes she's looking at the group of friends you with. And if they all look kind of dusty and, and bummy as fuck and stuff, I mean, 
Mm, and she looking at it's like you know you what they say uh, birds together fly together or flock together or whatever so I mean you know that kind of that's a it's a lot of different scenarios you know what I mean that I could go on but this is just some of the quick stuff off the top of my head to basically just say hey you know what I mean it, I think it's great that men still want to go up and let girls know that you guys are beautiful and stuff I think at the same time women need to be more open and receptive and at least taking the compliment i ain't say date him i ain't say get his number i ain't say fuck him that is all on you all i'm saying is basically you know chill out a little bit not every man is a predator not every man is a you know <laughs> low-key molester or whatever so um you know give man a chance in time but comment subscribe below let me know what you think